Director of Community Services. It happened in August of last year, and now Senator Frederick Love says it was racially motivated. Channel 7's Andrew Mobley and photojournalist Michael Gabbard spoke with Love and his attorney today to find out more. Andrew. Love's lawsuit filed March 19th contains some very serious allegations, including a potential violation of Arkansas's Whistleblower Act. In his lawsuit against the county, Love asserts that in his time as a county official, he had been subjected to a hostile work environment and unwarranted investigations, both racially motivated. Love says he was treated differently than other employees on account of his race, naming one Caucasian county employee who, despite facing accusations of sexual assault against minors, was kept on until no longer, quote, politically expedient to do so. It makes you feel bad to know that someone else is being treated better than you are based on your race. It really does. And so um, to stand up in the face of a lot of things, it, it, that's what I need to do. Love says he was ultimately pressured to resign or be terminated over a dispute that stemmed from his firing of the county housing director under his authority as director of community services. Love alleged that Pulaski County Judge Barry Hyde even told him that he had done nothing wrong, but it was best he resign anyway. Senator Love was told he had done nothing wrong. Uh, and, and when you look at other county employees we cited in the lawsuit and look at how the county stood behind them as opposed to how they forced Senator to love out, then that is the basis why we filed this lawsuit because we believe that he was a victim of discrimination based on his race. Love resigned August 9th last year and says with his reputation damaged, he has since struggled to find employment and has been shunned. I haven't been able to, to gain employment uh, since that time. People tend to shy away from you. Uh, I've been dismissed from not only that job, but I've been dismissed from a couple of volunteer boards. Love says racial discrimination is a wider institutionalized issue in Pulaski County government and told KATV that he and other African-American county employees were consistently paid less than their white counterparts in violation of the Civil Rights Act. Of all institutions, we expect our county government, we expect our state government to adhere uh, to our anti-discrimination laws and so and it's just a sad reality that when when these types of lawsuits are brought because it does shine a light on the discrimination that goes on not only within the county government but also the state government. Pulaski County provided the following statement to KATV concerning Love's lawsuit. The county has not yet been served with the complaint. Pulaski County doesn't comment on pending litigation. However, Pulaski County Judge Barry Hyde says the allegations in the lawsuit are not true and he looks forward to addressing each one at the appropriate time. Love is seeking equitable and injunctive relief, reinstating him and giving him back pay, preventing the county from similar alleged discriminatory actions in the future, and providing him compensatory damages. On your side, I'm Andrew Mobley. Okay, Andrew, more to come on that. Thank you very much. The lawsuit has been filed with the U.S. District Court for the Eastern District of Arkansas. For more on Love's lawsuit, just check out our web story at KATV.com.